What is up, everybody? Um, I'm here uh, re-recording -re the Technic uh, Launcher Mod Pack uh, tutorial. Um, it seems like you guys keep on having trouble, and I want to help you guys to do this. So, yeah. First thing you're going to want to do is get your mods, obviously. Um, get whatever version. I normally get my mods from skyguys.com. Uh, I trust them pretty well. Um, and, like, I just pick whatever mods I wanted. So, I'm just for the record, if you hear any noise in the background, I'm sorry for that. I, I'm trying my best. Uh, this is not my normal setup. Anyways, so I got my two mods here. Uh, Lucky Blocks mod and, uh, I don't know how to pronounce that, Minimap. And so, now I must install Minecraft Forge. What you guys must, um, uh, do is you have to make sure it's the exact version. And then install the uh, universal. So I'm gonna install it in front of you guys uh, because I am. I, I haven't. Like, don't click on this by the way. Uh, just click skip in here. And I, now I'm gonna just close my, that page. And I'm gonna, once this is done, I'm gonna drag it. Just for the record, this is a slightly slower computer compared to my own at home. So, this is going to be a little bit different, so I'm going to do my best to keep, and then drag it to your desktop. Wait, wait for it to load on your desktop. It's not loading, which is weird, so let me just quickly open up my installs. Show in a folder. Show in. Thank you. Uh, well, let's drag that. For the record, guys, just before you make this mod pack, I seriously recommend testing the mods um, in your normal Minecraft, which I did, as I tested these two, and then um, in my normal Minecraft, and then once it was done, I made uh, it was working. So now I know it's working. So what you want to do is create a folder called mod pack um, and then inside that folder you're going to want to create two uh, which is bin and then one mods make sure that it's not capitalized or anything like that it has to be like this exactly and then in for the universal forge you're going to want to right click it rename mod pack and then in there, you're gonna uh, and then you're gonna want to open up bin, drag the mod pack um, file into the bin. Then you're gonna want to open up mods and then drag the two mods into mods. Once that is done, you're gonna want to select these two, um, add to archive, um, and then zip, and then I'm gonna call it. Yeah, I'm just gonna leave it as mod pack. I'm gonna do that. Uh, next, you want to what you're gonna want to do is open up Dropbox, create a new folder. I'm gonna do uh, call this one um, mod pack for tutorial. All right, so I'm gonna open that one up, and then I'm gonna go here, drag it, drag this into the mod pack. Place. Once this is done, um, uh, we will continue, um, which is going to be in a few seconds. <clears throat> Sorry, it takes a little bit for stuff. Uh, now it should be done, right? All right. Now you're wanna, gonna you're gonna want to click share, um, create a link right there, and then copy link. Close that. Now what you're going to want to do is um, go to your technic.net dashboard, um, sign in, create a mod pack, um, uh, Python's second um, mod pack tutorial, um, and oh, okay, cool. For a second I thought I didn't have the version. So it's going to be 1.10.2. 
Um, and then short description testing. Cool. Then I agree. Make sure you read them. Um, because yeah, because they're um, mod terms. I've already read them. Um, then you want to click create, and boom, you have it. Now you're gonna want to click edit mod pack. Mod pack location. Paste the um, length that you got from Dropbox and change that zero to a one. Once that is done, you want to do update mod pack, and then you're gonna want to click install this mod pack up in the top. Um, wait for it to load. <laughs> Obviously. Oh, wait. Uh, let's go to the actual page. It won't load for a second. For some reason. Um, now let's click install. Should work. Okay, there we go. I'm going to uh, control A to get that and copy. Then I'm going to open up my Technic launcher. Um, it's, it take a while for me. Uh, just by the way, guys, a cool little new thing. Uh, side note, I have gotten my two. Uh, they're almost done, but my I'm getting my logos done, as I told you in my update uh, video. And they're very close to being done. Um, we're just going back and forth for some updates, um, but it's going pretty well. So I'm going to want to click install. And it's going to say that, which is okay. Um, now what I'm going to want to do is click uh, edit the mod pack again. Then go to pages. Um, I just find this helps it a little bit. Um, testing, or sorry, um, this mod pack is for my um, mod pack tutorial on YouTube. And then um, I'm going to change the saved. I just asked, I just pressed enter and it and entered it. Now I'm going to go to versions. Um, I'm going to call it 1.1.1. 1.1.1. And then plus added the files. An update version. Now it takes last time it took around five minutes for this to um, render the new um, thing. Uh, sorry, the new uh, update that I put in um, to it. So I'll be back if it's not loaded uh, this time. I'll be back once it is. Sorry, for just a quick note, um, whenever you're waiting for it, I recommend just closing um, like technical launcher and then reopening it up um, pretty much every time you can um, until you see uh, the text, which is right here. You want to see that being uh, to update so you know it's updated, and then also you want the latest updates to be updated as well. Um, then you can click install, then it will actually functionally work. Um, so I'm going to basically be doing that um, while uh, I'm waiting. So I'll be back once it's done, um, and I'll tell you around the uh, amount of time that it took for the uh, waiting time. Okay, so it still hasn't loaded, but another quick thing. I just noticed um, once I opened it up while I was waiting and it said offline right underneath my name. So I quickly um, searched up what to do. And then what you're going to want to do is just go to your history online and um, clear it for some reason, even though it didn't really do anything. Um, uh, it seemed to work and then I opened it back up and then boom, it was uh, there was no more offline sign. Uh, but just make sure that you close it before um, you actually do that. Um, so yeah, um, now I'm, it's been like eight minutes now and it still hasn't loaded. And I'm wondering why it's taking so long. Um, I do not know why. But again, I'll get back to you once it is done. Okay, so um, 
basically uh, also at the very end if you start to see that it's taking a little bit uh like a long time uh just don't open it for around two to three minutes um i also edited the text one more time to say um in brackets python gamer exclamation mark uh and then i opened it back up and then boom it was uh, everything was there so now i'm gonna click install it should work there should be no reason why it doesn't all right now it's grabbing everything apparently um so i'm gonna let this install um and enjoy the speed installation on your screen Okay guys, so this installation is going to take a while, so I'm going to quickly pause the video here, um, and I'm going to quickly get some pictures, and I'm going to um, basically show you guys how to add pictures to your mod pack. Alright guys, so I'm going to basically show you how to make the pictures um, uh, at the very end pack.net and um, I don't know why I closed this um, so the installation is done it took around 10 minutes I would want to, I want to say eight minutes I don't know um, my mod packs um, again I'm sorry if there's any background noise um, edit mod pack um, now resources um, um, and like there's not one second. Okay, um, so what you're gonna want to do to for the mod pack icon, you need 50 by 50 mod pack logo, thir uh, 370 by 220, and then by mod pack background, 900 by 600. So I chose happy face for the 50 by 50. I don't know how much that is, but I'm hoping that will work for my pet logo, and then this will be the background. Um, now let's try it now. Uh, happy face for logo. Um, let's see if this picture will work, hopefully. Okay, cool. And then this picture. Now, update resources. Ugh, please tell me it worked. Cool, it worked. Now let's. It's probably gonna have to reload the whole thing. Like I'm gonna have to add even uh, add another update. So let's just close that. Versions added resources. Um, one point one point two. Um, add did re uh, pictures. All right, now um, let's hope. Well, it's already here now. Now let's check Technic Launcher. Uh, let's just drag those into my mod pack because I don't want those on my desktop anymore. Mod pack. Uh, yes. I don't know what it's installing now. Honestly, what is it installing? Ugh. Okay, it's probably reinstalling. Is it reinstalling the entire thing? Oh, it's installing Minecraft again. Minecraft assets took the longest. Oh, okay. Cool. So now we're launching the actual thing. And I'm, I know this video is much longer. 
uh, compared to the other one, but I want to make sure that I get all the information I can can in this because it seems like you guys got super confused uh, for some other stuff on your computer and I do not know why it was not working for you guys. You said it wasn't loading with Forge or um, mods. Uh, if you follow exactly what I did, it should work because right now it is lo loading with Forge. Um, now let's hope it's actually loading with the mods. Um, it says uh, initializing the two mods, so I, it sounds like it, it looks like it's working. Um, so I'm hoping for the best right now. <laughs> okay. Almost done. Uh, the game might not load. Uh, it may take a little bit to um, play a game. Like I'm gonna load the world again to show you guys exactly uh, if it's working or not. It's fine. I don't care. Single player um, testing, and then there. Let's just start it on creative. So now it's loading. Um, Oh, I think the GUI is way too big. I forgot to update that. Um, now, uh, just give it a minute to build the world. Um, so, like, I can actually show you. Um, yeah. I'm going to leave this in because it shouldn't take too long. Because, yeah, on my normal Minecraft, it didn't take too long. Wait for it. Options, uh, video settings, fast, brightness all the way. Let's turn that down a little bit. Uh, off, and there we go. Just to help this a little bit, to speed up, hopefully. So, as you can see, there's the mini map already there. Um, it's lagging pretty badly. Um, because it's like generating the entire world. So let's just open up our inventory and then let's check for lucky blocks. All right, so lucky blocks are here again. Um, let's go to game mode S and then place that one down, break it. Cool, I get cats. I'm pretty sure this is, uh, well, there's your problem. Okay, cool. And I'm pretty sure this is a really lucky one. Yep, really lucky one. Hero's helmet and hero's leggings. So there you have it, guys. Um, this is how to make a mod pack. I hope you enjoyed um, and, and figured out how to make it once again. Um, I really hope this also fixed all your problems that you were having. Uh, again, I didn't have any problems on myself. So yeah, if you ever have any problems, again just post it down in the comments uh, uh post down in the comments your uh skype username and i will add you through my skype um my youtube skype and um if you add me yourself i will not know it was you uh unless you said your exact username on your channel and said um like um uh, uh something to make sure like let's say you said I'll say hi on the uh, friend request uh, thing um, and then you said hi then I would accept it because I know it was you and then you also you have to again put in your um, real um, YouTube name again but again there's a couple of Python gamers um, out there with that same name on uh, you on um, Skype so it might be a little bit hard to find m me exactly. I mean, it should be the same picture as my um, channel. Uh, so, yeah. Alright, I, I hope you guys, again, enjoyed. And I'll see you all later.